Hey, by the way, uh, I, I've been playing uh, Forever Lost, and uh, I'm lost. <laughs> <laughs> You'll be there forever. I can't seem to get out of uh, the first part of the asylum. I got out of the room. Yeah. And I've 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 discovered quite a few things, but I <laughs> I think I'm uh you'll probably need to do the xylophone puzzle, which okay. everyone hates, okay. as we found out, because yeah. no one can tell the difference between notes in that the sound of notes. Okay. So everyone yeah, that's a hard one that everyone seems to get stuck on basically. So good luck with that one. Right, okay. Could you do uh I haven't seen it yet, so could you could you do uh Colored keys. Uh, well, the thing is, the problem is, is we actually do, they are actually colored, oh, okay. and we have, uh, but that doesn't that's not, that's not actually helping them. It's making it worse <laughs> because just as a, as a joke, we put um, uh, like a, a cardboard co uh, like a book version of our first app in there, our kids book, and that's all about colors. Uh -huh. So everyone's spending hours reading that and thinking that's the the clue to the actual puzzle, and they're just completely way off base and makes it even worse. So. Yeah, one throwaway joke has confused more people than anything, really. That's interesting. That's interesting. Lack of testing, really. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's okay. Yeah, I, uh, I was. There was a moment. There, I guess it kind of the similar thing. The when you initially play the game that's on the, the coffee table, and you're like yeah. that, that. You're like that little thing that runs around. I, there were so many things that I was like, for, for so many moments that I was like, is this part of the like? Is this just like a side <laughs> note, or is this part of the game? Is this is there information here? You know, yeah, so. we kind of took we went a bit. That that was meant to be a, a two minute puzzle. Ended up being two weeks worth of sprite drawing. Yeah, yeah, a bit we, of effort. Yeah, I can imagine. Yeah, it, I, I was amazed that you you put a game instead of a game. I thought that was cool. You're gonna like episode two then. <laughs> What's that? There's a few more of those. Oh, in episode. You're gonna, you're gonna like episode two. Yeah, oh. there's a few more of those. Okay, good, good. We went even more overboard. <laughs> Have you ever played any of the uh, Slender games or anything like that? Uh, well, we saw thousands of them came out, and I was never really sure where they all sort of came from. But uh, there was one of the one recent ones that actually looked pretty good, as opposed to all the ones that was like thousands of. Mm -hmm. Not good ones. Yeah. I just wonder. The, the Forever Lost has sort of that. I keep waiting for Slender to jump out. We could probably put him in there as just a little, uh, just as a reference to yeah. that. Really. Yeah. We've maybe, got enough references in there, so yeah. Yeah. Put some maybe some, uh, uh, like he's in the background of a photo someplace. <laughs> well, our our plan after all Forever Lost is done is to do an actual proper like scary scary game from the from the offset and we've got loads of ideas for it so we'll stick him in there somewhere as well just for just for funsies yeah yeah that's good stuff yeah i could see how that would be uh you could easily make a scary game just because yeah there's loads of stuff we can mess with and stuff it'd be quite cool it's yeah. just yeah getting the episode three out of the way so we can start on another a fresh game get rid of all the baggage of forever lost so you got a third you got plans for a third one Technically, we've got plans for a fourth, but that might be a bit much. We've got the story fits to three games, and we could do a fourth, but there'd be a much shorter one, more like a sort of just a conclusion part, 69p, couple of hours long type thing. 